this is not tall enough. Hello everyone, starting my vlog in the evening, well it looks darker than it actually is, it's actually only 10 to 5, but it looks very dark outside um, and I'm up in my office and I just thought I'm just going to start vlogging now. So I'm just up here on my laptop in my office getting very excited about the next couple of days because it's basically Halloween time which has gone so quickly like I'm actually kind of sad how quickly the end of this year is going I always feel like the start is so slow I feel like January has like 50 days in it <laughs> and then it gets to spring and summer oh yeah um yeah and then spring and summer comes around and there's loads of fun things to do and I don't feel like that goes particularly quick but then this time of year you blink and it's over which is sad because it is like my favorite time of year I love it going through some of the PO box stuff that I've brought back from the office um, because I tend to sort through it in the office and decide which things to go to charity which things to go to um, homeless shelters etc etc like I make a pile for my mum I make a pile for like my mum for a charity raffle <laughs> there's so many piles and then the things I decide to bring back here that I want to like try or put into my makeup um, I was gonna say makeup bag but we all know I don't just have a bag <laughs> um, I make up like drawers um and like bits of clothing and stuff but once i've sorted it into the office it just kind of comes here and then i put it up here in this room and then it requires like a further sort out that usually gets a bit put off if i've been busy but i'm gonna sit and do a little bit bit now one thing that i did want to put on whilst i did it from our little trip to lewis um which was in my last vlog i bought two um records i got the beach boys 20 golden grates oh my god it smells old i love that smell it smells like my nan's spare bedroom <laughs> and then queen sheer heart attack i think i'm gonna put this one on because it's literally all of the best beach boys songs and that makes me very happy let's go and put it on i hope it works i haven't tested it it was only three pounds <laughs> oh i need to plug it in i think there we go got the music on i keep all my little records under here in this unit actually lots of you ask me about this and my dressing table in my bedroom this is G plan um, I believe it is from the 60s or 70s probably seven mm, 70s 80s I'm not actually too sure um, but the, the brand is G plan and I got this I feel like I got this from Poppy and Sean I think they were, they were gonna get rid of it I can't remember. Poppy Sean, did I take this from you because you didn't have space for it or something? Um, and the one I have downstairs, which is my little dressing table in my bedroom, which there's a picture on Instagram if you need reference. That I ordered on eBay in 2014 when I first moved to Brighton. And I think, that, did they send it or did I go and pick it up? I can't remember, but it was really cheap. And I just searched G Plan Dresser in eBay and that, and that popped up. It's just one of those things I get asked a lot that's just reminded me. So a couple of little bits that I really wanted to share with you because um, I'm going through all the stuff down here. This, which is the Caroline Hirons Winter Kit. It is a makeup bag. Firstly, I flip and love the makeup bag anyway. It's sick. Um, secondly, it is it has 12 full-sized skincare products and they're all brands that Caroline uses and reviews and raves about. And if you've been watching me for a while, then you may have heard the name Caroline Hirons crop up every now and then because she's basically my skincare guru <laughs> and my friend. Um, so if anything goes on with my skin or there's a product I'm not sure about, I will text her or I will always go on her blog or her website. And she's reviewed so many skincare products. Honestly, you have to go and watch her videos and look at her website her reviews are incredible she's so like real about everything and i love that about her um and she has 
created this kit with all these amazing skincare brands. I feel like this will probably be sold out by the time you watch this because I just know that this will like fly. Um, but a couple of things we've got in here, we've got the Emma Hardy, what? Emma Hardy cleansing balm. You guys know I love that. Got a Murad moisturizer, a Kate Somerville liquid exfoliate. Um, we have Oskia bedtime beauty boost. Never used that, but I'm really excited to give it a try. Medic 8 Beauty Pie. There's so many products in here and I was just super excited and also just like super happy for Caroline. So just wanted to share that with you and also just share Caroline with you if you've not seen me mention her before. Another thing that I'm quite excited about is this. Now my friend and the gorgeous woman who does my hair, Sam, I always say to her, Sam, I think I suck at curling my hair with straighteners. She says, no, you don't, but this is what I use because she understands that it is more difficult to do your own hair with straighteners if you're going for like a waved look. Um, I've definitely improved, I think, but she said she uses this um, instead of straighteners on her own hair. She said she'll use straighteners on other people's hair because she finds it much easier. But she said for her own hair to get really relaxed beachy waves, she'll use this. This is the GHD Curve Tong Soft Curl. Um, and GHD really very kindly sent me this because Sam messaged them and said that she thinks that I would probably be very appreciative of one. <laughs> and I am. I've not tried it yet, obviously, but yeah it looks exciting sam's already given me a little tutorial so once i feel like i've mastered it i will share although i'm pretty sure she's already she's done loads of great like hair tutorials and things on her instagram and on her youtube but yeah thank you ghd that was very kind of you sending that over to me another thing that i wanted to share with you as you guys know i've been working with desenio um who are the amazing company that do all the prints that you could ever imagine. I did my wall in my spare room with them and basically if I ever buy any prints, I get them from Desenio. Each month, myself and the Zoella team have been picking our favorite prints from the website and they've been on their own landing page. I've seen lots of you guys saying that you've loved it because it's given you inspiration and you love seeing what we've been loving on the site as well, which has been amazing. So make sure to go over to the website and check out our November picks. So that's me and the rest of the Zoella Team. so if you think you've got I mean I don't know interior style that's a bit more suited to Maddie or to Danielle or one of the other girls in the office then um, their picks are also in there as well kind of it's a nice combination I think which works quite nicely because lots of different people have different like tastes um, so yeah we've really enjoyed doing that these are a couple of the ones that were selected for this month which I'm gonna try and put somewhere because I love them the first one is this one and it's a typewriter and it just says fuck it and I kind of love that this one which I mean it goes with this time of year it's an autumn leaf but like super zoomed in um, I've got that one in a gold frame and then this one which was one of my picks too this is, again, two leaves. I honestly think I'm, I've been slightly inspired by outside <laughs> for this month's picks. Um, but two leaves that just look like they've been scanned in. I don't know what it was about this, but I was so drawn to it. It's just so simple, but I love it. So those are three of the ones, but as I said, go on over, check out all the others. There is also a November offer, which means that you get 40% off prints that doesn't include hand-picked, personalized, all the frames, just as an FYI. So as a little offer in the run-up to Singles Day, you can get 40% off if you use the code ZOELLA in capital letters um, across all Desenio sites right up until midnight on November the 11th. So you don't have too long. So if you've been eyeing anything up, make sure you go on over and use it. 40% is an incredible deal. So I would not pass up on this opportunity if you've got like a space in your home or something that you've been eyeing up for a while. It's a great deal. Thank you, Desenio. I think I might put one up here actually. I feel like I need a little, I don't know which one. I, I think I quite like the fuck it one. I'm not gonna lie. Hee <laughs> 
maybe this side. Oh my god, this smells incredible. This came to my PO box a while ago actually, it's by Boo and Mimi and it says fur mum, which I am, I'm a little fur mummy. Okay, I love that. I quite like the black and white, I think it goes well. I forgot to show this one, but this one was also one of the picks. And I quite like that it's a little bit smaller. And that it's pink. <gasps> Yay, okay, love that. Now having like a little bit of a shuffle. <laughs> Um, if you're wondering why I have surfboards wrapped up in bubble wrap here, these are my Teen Choice Awards. <laughs> um, one from 2015 and one from 2014. And they are actual um, surfboards that you can actually surf on. But I have no idea <laughs> what to do with them. I don't think here is the correct place for them to be, but I mean, yeah. This looks cute though. <laughs> right, I'm gonna fully tackle this room. I'm gonna turn the Beach Boys up super loud and just crack on. So I think I'm gonna come back to you tomorrow because Mark is coming over and he's not really been in like the most autumn festive mood. And if someone tells me that, I take on that task and that like responsibility and role very seriously. So I have a little autumn plan planned a little autumn plan for us tomorrow to hopefully get him a little bit more in the festive spirit so yeah i'll see you tomorrow good morning it's the day before halloween and weirdly i'm feeling ill again like what is it with this time of year time of year i've been hanging out with every basically everyone's had this illness and i've been hanging out with people who have also got it when I'm recovering from it. So I don't know if you can catch it twice, but I'm just not feeling it today. My bones hurt, I feel cold. Ah, oh, it's so frustrating. I'm gonna need like a vitamin B injection or something, or a flu jab. I'm powering through. I have got all the layers on and myself and Mark, who is here, he's just running to get his um, tripod mount so I can put it up in here. We're gonna go out, get a bit of fresh air. Um, there's this really cute uh, place. I was gonna say near me, but it's not near me at all. It's called Slindon, and it's like just past Arundel. And it's like this tiny little courtyard, and every year the man that owns it does a pumpkin display. Um, and he does a different thing every year. And I've been there once before and it was just really cute and very autumnal. And I think it would be nice for us to go and see what he's done this year. So that's what go. we're gonna do. Yay! Oh. Do you wanna stick it on? Stick him on. Stick him on. Essentials. Oh, oh. <laughs> did you forget your inhaler? All the time. <laughs> <sighs> right. How you feeling, love? I'm feeling good. Yeah? I've got like a sore nose. So not that good. Oh no, I feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling good. Got a sore nose though. Got a sore snozzle. Um, snozzle. Let's hit the road. We've got some pumpkins to look at. Just to let you know, this place is so tiny. Right. It's just really cute. I was going to say, ain't you got enough fucking pumpkins? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not buying any. I just want to go and see it. Okay, amazing. It's just really cute to see and very like autumnal. Yeah, and, like... I left mine, you know, we went to the thing. What I left, thing? Um, when we actually went pumpkin picking. Yeah. I left them in, the, in my boot. Did they go all like... <sighs> they were dying for about two weeks. Did you leave them in there for two weeks? Yeah. <laughs> Where are they now? Bin. <laughs> Bin. Bin. Okay, well, I mean, you could buy a new one today if you want. Yeah. I've got quite a lot. <laughs> yeah. You could probably just take I'll buy one. one or two of mine. Yeah. I just do feel really sad that I haven't made any effort this Halloween. I know. Apart from that one candlestick. That I got from Have you put, even put it up in your flat? It's in a cupboard. Oh, what's wrong with me? Mark! I know. This is partly why we're doing today. Yeah. Because Mark is just not in the autumn Halloween spirit. Nah. What's wrong with you? I don't know. I've got money now, sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I just, just I feel very SAD. So do I. I put that <laughs> on my Insta Instagram today. Did you? 
Lots of people said to buy a light. Buy a light, get some vitamin D in you. Yeah. Um, yeah, um, I actually did write that on the comments of my Instagram. SAD is seasonal affective disorder, which affects people in both the summertime. Yeah. Who's getting sad in that summertime? Well, it's not, it's not about being sad. It's like there's lots of different... Interesting. So some people struggle because of the heat. Oh, okay, that's and fair And it enough, makes them yeah. feel lethargic and like they don't have the energy and yeah. like their bodies don't feel like they're used to it. Um, but here in the UK, I feel like most people suffer with SAD in this time of year yeah. because the clocks go back. And for us, it now starts to get dark at like half five. Yeah, if But that. it will become half four over time. Mm. In the run-up to Christmas, in December, it'll be half past four and it'll be pitch black. Yeah. Um, so it is weird. Like, it takes me a while to adjust. Yeah. You just have to make sure you're doing something fun, getting outside every day, making yeah, plans sure. in the evening. Yeah, because I sit down on my sofa and I'm like, bedtime. Same. That's literally what I said in my caption. It gets to 7pm and I'm like, I could literally sleep. Yeah. It's frustrating, isn't it? Mm. Maybe we should find some vitamin D. I think we should. <laughs> Let's go on the hunt for some vitamin D and pumpkins. <laughs> anyway, that is it. More positive. Come on, get your positive. Yeah, out. come on. Come on. Posy vibes. Pos vibes. Posy, posy, pumpkin vibes. Pump, pump a nickel. You know pump a nickel. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You remember I bought you an Alfie bread that the first time I came oh out. Oh my god. Pump a nickel bread. And what was that funny little cartoon you made us watch? That black and white thing. Oh no. <laughs> Bumble, Mr. Bumble, Wumble. Mr. Bumble, Wumble. Something. Oh. oh good times. Good times. Good times. Be at work. There. There. Oh, my <laughs> God. Dear old Bumble, Wumble, drop. Please, can I call you that? Hello, dear old Bumble, Wumble, drop. <laughs> right, anyway, let's go and see these pumpkins. That'll put you in the mood. Yeah, it will. I am excited. And then we'll come back and we'll watch a cosy film. Yeah. Have a cup of tea. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, what are we watching? Oh, we haven't decided. You yet, can have choose. I? Okay, cool. But it has to be Halloween because I did say no to a scandal and I was like, nah, I can't watch that. <laughs> I mean, that's not really going to get you in a Halloween mood. <laughs> no, okay. Um, but cool. yeah, amazing. Right, well, we'll probably film a little bit on the way and then we'll see you there. All right. I was like, I'm not going to tan anymore. I'm just going to let my skin breathe. What do you mean? I don't know. I was just, <laughs> just like, I'm not going to tan for a while. You do look quite tanned. Yeah, I did put quite a lot on today. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you smell like celery. Have you got celery on? No, do I? There must be a. Nose. I can smell celery. <laughs> I think it's just fret spray. It can't. It's alien. Oh. I just got a whiff of celery. It's here. it was you. No. Oh, maybe it's this. <laughs> <laughs> that just smells like banana. Ah! Uh, it's pissed on you. <laughs> Things we do on our, in our sleep really scares me. What do you do? I scratch. <laughs> the walls yourself? <laughs> oh my god, the walls. <laughs> Can you imagine like your climbing pillow, the wall, yeah. your floor? But look, I have like little scratch marks in my hands because I grow my nails and I'm not used to it. And in the night, I feel like I'm being touched. So I'm like scratching. Yeah. Oh. It scares me a lot. Sometimes I can't, I can't breathe. In my house? No, not, well, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I, remember that, I remember that one time I always went to hospital for dehydration because I, um, well, I'm obviously being dramatic. <laughs> but I had a bath in your old house. Yeah. In your top, top room. Yeah. And the window was shut and I didn't know how to open it. And it was a really hot bath. And I just got really hot. <laughs> you went to hospital? No, I could have gone to hospital. <laughs> Dehydration. I mean, at the time. At the time, I was fine. <laughs> it, was, it was just very, very hot. <laughs> You could have told me I would have come and opened the window. Thank you. <laughs> bit late now, isn't it? Bit late. <laughs> Two years too late. Oh, yes! Come Go on! You got this! You yeah. got it! I, I want to watch like a really immersive, like, sort of broad churchy drama thriller. Oh, yeah. Just in 
the mood for my that. My favourite. Yeah. I can't do, do, do. Shake your pineapple, shake, shake your tree. To I the left, do. to the right. Is that about yeah, about uh, something? Do you want to move in here? Wow, tight little. That's all right. You're welcome, babes. Mm -hmm. No worries at all. Don't worry yourself. You're all good. Have a nice day. Ta ta. Oh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I sort of predicted that. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> I'm psychic, Sal. What happened? I don't know. I sort of predicted that they were going to slow down, and I went. <laughs> Oh my god, everyone calm down. I love this little journey we do. Yeah. Do you remember? I remember it so well. It's gonna make me emotional. There was still a little part of you that was like trying to come out the shell a bit. Me? Yeah, but we had the roof down and we were singing. And you were getting into it and you were singing, but you were like constantly looking around like, oh, someone's looking, someone's looking. <laughs> and now you're like, fuck it. Fuck it. Sing song. And, I, and then you sent me the loveliest text later. And I remember like, that day. Yeah, that was a great day. It was spring. Yeah. I remember it. Mini down, yeah. tunes up, and people were just like driving past. I just remember feeling so happy, like a weight had like lifted. That was it, yeah. Was Did such... I say that to you in my text? Yeah, it was such a lovely text. I think oh, I cried. Policier. They finally got out! My worst fear is getting arrested. For something you didn't do? Yeah. Yeah. You can't shake that feeling. I know a few people who, who have a fear of that. Yeah. I think as long as you're not in the wrong place at the wrong time, mm -hmm. or doing anything si slightly similar to a murder, yeah, then you'll probably be okay. <laughs> or if you don't look like a murderer. I always get searched at airports. Do you? Yeah. I wonder why. I look. Do you think it could be your metal arsehole? <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it's the steel rod I carry up my arsehole all the time. Or your pierced penis. I was that thinking, must be yeah, it. my it's pierced penis and my metal your roddy big, dildo. Is it called a King Arthur? Prince Philip? Prince Jules. <laughs> King no, Jules. Jules? Is it Jules? No, I think it's called a Prince Albert. Bing's Brank. <laughs> Called a Prince Albert. Prince Albert, that's it. Yeah. Binks, Binks. Prince, Prince Jules. <laughs> What's happening to I love that we're just says? sat like reminiscing right now. <laughs> I love it when people recognise you. What did they do? <laughs> their face just their face just makes a face. Do you know what I mean? Like their face just go like from normal to be like. That's <laughs> my favourite thing. Legs first, knees up, ra ra ra. <laughs> oh God. You're so long, aren't you? Yeah, I was saying this to my mum earlier. I'm so tall. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Sorry, Slindon. <laughs> We're here. Oh, God, it's like dolphins and whales and octopus. Oh, oh my God, it's so cute. This is, I feel autumn now. Yes, I knew it would work. I feel autumn now. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> it's rock hard, I think it's fake. It's not. That's real. How do you eat it? Oh, is that real? I don't think it is. Yeah, that's real. That is real. Look at this thing. <laughs> Happy with the um, pumpkin display? Yeah, what's inside? Oh, I don't know. Let's go in. Let's have a look. Pumpkin display. Oh my god, can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> they opened the door. <laughs> Which better get my candy? Which better get my candy? Look at this cute little house. We're just having a little stroll through Slindon now. Look at that. Mark saw the word cafe and ran. <laughs> <laughs> 200 yards, they said. Oh, sit there. Okay. <laughs> I love how like bossy I am with photo shoots. Sit there, <laughs> put a leg up. A leg up. <laughs> so we found the pumpkin cafe, but also look at this beautiful tree. <gasps> look how amazing this tree is. And then all the leaves along the ground. Run, go on Mark, quick. <laughs> they didn't accept cards, so sadly, no hot drink for you. 
Oh, Where are we going to go now then? I feel like we're on a little adventure. No. <laughs> let's go to Blood. Let's go to Swindon. <laughs> <laughs> Mark keeps calling Slindon Swindon. He's like, I'm moving to Swindon. <laughs> Do you know how far away that is from here? It's not in England, is it? Swindon? Yeah. <laughs> is it? It is, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's near where I used to live. Oh, that's what yeah. I keep saying it. Um, so it's like ooh, two hours 45 away from here. I've got time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this time of the evening is like my favourite. Yeah. When all the like birds start singing and the bats come out and then... <laughs> Look! These are my faves. Oh. Aya! Hi, <laughs> can you see me reversing? <laughs> Beep! 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 So what did you think of Slindon? I loved it! Isn't it so cute? It was a lovely little Wednesday surprise. Is it making you feel a little bit more... That, that did, yeah. That little... In the spirit? Yeah. The little calf. Oh. Everyone's like jumping around that little tinsel house. <laughs> that was lovely. I just really wish that someone opened the door. <laughs> what door? You know when you were going, Oh, where's your mail? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's Halloween. And uh, myself and Mark have just been chilling this morning. We watched Casper. Mark cooked us breakfast. First. So you can go over and watch that on his vlog. Um, it was really hard to just stand and watch. <laughs> We're having some people around tonight. It's just a small little Halloween get together. We're going to watch a scary film and just like eat food and chill, which I'm really excited about. So I need to go out and buy some bits. I think I'm going to do like an ultimate cheese board um, because I think people are coming at like eight. So it's like past dinner time, but still something nice to snack on during the film um, and then we're probably going to carve some pumpkins and decorate the house a little bit for Halloween and yeah first Christmas advert it's really cute I think it's DFS we're ready we're gonna head into town because Mark needs to grab some bits and we need to buy stuff to eat tonight. Yeah. Just thought I'd show you a little outfit of the day. I've got a headband, which I think is Oliver Bonus. And then my bag that Alfie got me, which is off-white. These trousers are from ASOS, but I think they're Bershka. Or, no, oh, are they Bershka? Would you mind checking for me, love? Yeah. I feel like they're Bershka or the other brand that I can't think, can't think of what it's called. Bershka. 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 Um, I've got me Converse, I've got this jacket in case it is a bit colder than I think, which is from Amazon Prime, but also Wrangler. This is from Joni, I just thought it was very apt for today, since it's Halloween. Then I've got the Estee Lalonde Daisy First Collection on, and then this one, oh, I never know where this came from, but this was in a, I'm not even showing you, this was in a press release with Charlotte Tilbury, but I don't remember where it came from, but it's just so pretty. I'm so scared I'm gonna break it though, it's so dainty. Um, and then this cardigan, I think is a Topshop cardigan, but it's pretty old. Is that Topshop? Yeah. So that's, that's me outfit. Just thought I'd show you, quite like it. You are. I really like the LA one, but I just, I'm gonna get the LA one. No one's really looking at my back, are they? <laughs> <laughs> Buying some cozy clothes for his flight tomorrow. It's just, I don't mind the back, you know. Yeah, I don't want to see it with the hood anyway. No. Then um, what trousers are you going to go? Do you reckon like black joggers? Mm, yeah, maybe. Yeah, to go with the black on the. These. Yeah. Me and Mark just bought some churros. We're all done with shopping. Yeah, I think that was a successful shop. Yeah. They're so crispy. Oh, God. Oh God. <laughs> Bruno. <laughs> Bruno. Honestly, go for one of them. I'm gonna go for the little bent one. Little walking stick. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it's drippy. I think this is one of my favorite desserts. ASMR. Mmm. 
going to head to Waitrose. I was going to say Waitress. Waitress. We're now going to head to Waitrose and get everything I need for an epic cheese board. I'm very excited. Don't forget your chutney. Oh, I won't, baby. Oh, God. What? It's just like when I eat anything unhealthy, like my face automatically like goes shiny. You hate me, don't you? Your face is shiny. <laughs> is it? No. It's the, it's the opposite of shiny. It's matte. matte. But then if it was really matte, you'd say, oh, my face doesn't have any dewy yeah, glow. Yeah, I know. You know me so well, it hurts. I know. <laughs> what are you like? You don't realise how good your skin is. Thanks. Uh, I don't like it. I don't know why. I don't like compliments. Yes, you do. I hate compliments. No, you don't. I mean, obviously, they're lovely. Why do you hate them? I just get really, I don't know. When someone compliments me, I just feel like they're lying. Or it just makes me feel like, I don't know, I just can't take them. Can't take anything. If I was to say like. No, don't, I can't, I can't. Oh my God, you're, you have amazing eyelashes. Thank you. See? <laughs> yeah, I know, but I feel awkward. Why? I don't know. I just, I just, I've just never been able to take compliments. Cause I never got any growing up. Oh. Apart from my mum and dad, obviously. He looks made for Halloween. He does. Look Happy his... Halloween! <laughs> Mark! What? <laughs> I love how just now you're like, he's so confident. He's so, and you're like, I ain't. And then you're like, Happy Halloween! <laughs> oh no, I'm so confident in like social situations. I'll talk, I'll say hello. You've got no self confidence. That's exactly it. When I look in the mirror, I'm like, mm, you could be better. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, but everyone has days I know, like that. I know. That's just normal human. I'm a lot better than I used to be there. You used to be really bad. Oh, look, love. Oh, joy. You know, I did that um, hit and run with the pigeon the other day. Yeah. It turned out it was fine. So the pigeon drove into my windscreen and because I was on such a fast road, I couldn't turn around. I did actually turn around eventually and go back and he was fine. I think he was up a tree in the same exact spot where I did the hit and run with the pigeon, <laughs> that there was a, did, a dead pigeon in the exact same spot. So I feel like that pigeon was meant to die. Unless it was a different pigeon. Unless it was the same pigeon. Yeah, can you imagine? That's the one you hit. No, because it was, two, it was two weeks later and it looked fresh. No. No, don't it. tell me that. <laughs> I'll, I'll start crying. Do you? Yeah. Can't be mad, I'm gonna answer it. Hello? Hello? Hello! Okay, me and Mark have just had an explosion of saying the C word. Because <laughs> we never say it, do we? We never say it, so it was like we lifted the lid and then we just sat here for a couple of minutes saying all the different names we could think of where we put that in it. Yeah. My favourite was C-U-N-T Wart. <laughs> so f***y <laughs> Wart. <laughs> Port. Right. Don't say it. it's a very derogatory term. Very derogatory, very rude, very naughty. Sometimes you can't help it. I think we're quite naughty sometimes. I'm quite sweary and I only notice it when I'm hanging around my mum because every time I say one it's like a part of her dies inside. <laughs> no, no, my dad said you've got a foul mouth. Me? No. <laughs> I've got a foul mouth. It's got, I think we both do. Yeah, it's got a, what's it? Not toss pot. <laughs> Cockwomble. That's my favourite. <laughs> Cockwomble. <laughs> no, not filth pot. Something pot. Potty mouth. Potty mouth. Filth. <laughs> 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 toss pot. Filth pot. Potty mouth. <laughs> Go, Mark goes, I'm, I'm gonna get you. A, this is how some of our conversations go. I'm gonna get you a bag like they are woman at <laughs> No, not Hocus Pocus, the witches. the witches. And I was like, Oh, like a tapestry bag. And he went, What's a tapestry? Is it like a place that makes taps? I don't know. I don't do sewing, do I? Is that like a place that makes taps like a tap estuary? <laughs> <laughs> Love you, I'm love so you, silly. you filth pot. <laughs> right, let's get out of here. Okay. Come Thanks on, get out of <laughs> It's Halloween, the crows are out. Be careful. <laughs> take your nose. <laughs> those crows. <laughs> take your nose, those crows. 
Right. Got our bags. Got our bags. Let us. me just lock the car. Remember when you spoke to someone? Huh? The magpie. <laughs> Do you remember when you spoke to someone? The magpie. I always speak to it. Oh yeah, and you were like, what? And it spoke back. Yeah, you were no, like. No, I said, hello Mr. Magpie, how's your wife? And it went, ah! And you were like, ah! <laughs> At the cheese counter. counter. Trying all the cheeses. <laughs> So H&M have the cutest dog nits I ever did see. And we got this one for you. Look at you, you look so cute. In your little jumper. It literally fits her so perfectly. And they have lots of different colors and they're so soft. You get chilly this time of year, don't you? Go and show him. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, you look lovely. <laughs> Oh, your breath tinky winkies, though. <laughs> Eliminated. <gasps> Myself. Leah. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Who spoke? <laughs> Who spoke? <laughs> <laughs> Dare to argue with me. No, 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 I, I see. You gave me Schwanzo back. I was born until her blondes are black. Blondes. Foolish me. Is that a pain? A bitch. A bitch. A bitch. To say I'm wrong. Will not be with us. Very long. <laughs> Mark right. knows every word to this film. It's actually insane. Oh, no. Okay, should we do some cobwebs? Yeah, my favourite thing. Woohoo! Got cobwebs in me bum hole. Love you! <laughs> <laughs> you are so strong. I'm just a muscle man. <laughs> oh. Please tie up. Oh, I hate the feel of it on my dry skin. Yeah, it's horrid. Switch shops in England. <laughs> England. England. And you don't mind getting caught? I'm getting caught. Vilified. Vilified. Come on, Bruno. Come on, Bruno. Why does she do that? I don't know. <laughs> Moving on to Labyrinth! It's not a Halloween if we don't watch all of them in one day, is it? Do you remember when we, um... When we decorated last year? Was it last year or the year, year before? before? We were singing to this. Yeah. And you said, <laughs> I can't or something. Oh, yeah. Don't you understand that I can't? <laughs> yeah. Don't you understand that I can't? Don't you understand that I can't? What? <laughs> it smells like dishwasher down here. It's where my washing machine is. Oh, that's it. We're just <laughs> washing machine. Um, so we're coming down to the basement to see if there's any other decorations or anything. Can you hear that? <gasps> Fuck, Bruno! <laughs> <laughs> you have to duck down here. No. <laughs> Maybe put it on the porch outside. Yeah. Um, we've got Nala's costumes. Fun times, fun times, fun times. Look! Oh, look, this is it! This one! Yeah! Excuse me! Excuse me! <laughs> I like to go to the basement and sing my songs. Mark's getting his mate out. Oh, Skelly. There he is. He's fit, isn't he? So fit. <laughs> I forgot how big it was. <laughs> so I reckon we sit him on the hay bale. Okay. Do you think? Yeah, sounds good. Ooh. We've also found all of these battery candles to put out here. 
Oh my god, it's so dark. Oh, it smells nice out here. Yeah, that candle is insane. So I reckon if we sit him like... <laughs> Yeah! We should put a little pumpkin in his hand. Does his hand turn? No. So cool! We should put some cobweb out here. Yeah. I've got another bag on the dining room table. Okay, me and Mark have just put cobwebs <laughs> all over. So good. All down here. <laughs> all across here, all in the corn. Actually, the corn's a bit wonky. I need to sort that out. Look! <laughs> We've got this, this is where the cheese board's gonna go. And maybe some glasses and some water and drinks. <laughs> Nala, who, even though she has a jumper on, surely you don't want to sit by the fire with that on. Got all of this, Mark's just done this as well. Got all the cobwebs. And then I went and got some of the cushions that I have, the little halloween -y cushions. Mark put this here, which looks so funny. And then, oh, we've got some sweeties on the table. Not that we're gonna eat them all. <laughs> that as you come in. It's not really like a party or anything. Um, we're literally just gonna watch a film <laughs> and eat a cheese board. But I thought it would be nice to make it look Halloween-y anyway. So Alfie's on his way back. Huh? Oh, I'm just talking to my camera. Oh. <laughs> oh, flippin' heck, I just tripped over that. Careful. Alfie's on his way back, so we thought we'd um, scare him. We need front door keys, don't we? Yeah. We just have to make sure when he drives in, we really get tight behind that pillar. Okay. <laughs> Put your mask on. Shall I get behind? Shall I? You stand here then. Oh no, come on. Good show, hotel. <laughs> I'm going to fall for this as well, it's Alfie. Should you make? I don't just know we're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> How did I not even think of that? How did I not think that you'd be doing that? <laughs> Bloody hell. Did we scare you? You didn't scare me, but oh, I literally... <laughs> I don't know how I didn't guess that. What do you mean? I didn't, of course you two would be bloody hiding. <laughs> well, I don't know if that worked or not. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> cheese board has been done. There is a lot of cheeses on here. Some <laughs> more cheese darts. <laughs> Good enough for me. Good enough for me. <laughs> this sounds terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going right, for? Right, right. Wow, so far Alfie's just got a lot of cheese. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you've got a bit of another one as well. Yeah. What is that? I don't know. This one. Applewood. That's the one. That's the one you like, isn't it? Oh, smoked oh, apple. Oh, it's so good. I might give that one Oh my god, it's so smoky. Oh, I need some well, of these guys. I need to take this off. I like watching what people go for. Oh, I think the plan Everything that isn't mouldy. You're just going to stay there, aren't you, Sean? <laughs> I like how we went for a bigger plate. Beautiful. That's mine. Wow. Holy shit, look at mine. What do you mean? How else are you mine, meant to do it? <laughs> Sean lays his out like properly. Yeah, because then I'll just eat like this. <laughs> oh, I need to start again. No, <laughs> don't <laughs> 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 <laugh